Today, I'm in Dundee, Scotland, and what you're looking at is a model of the British research vessel, the RRS Discovery. The Discovery was launched in 1901 and was constructed specifically with Antarctic research in mind. And today, you and I are going to tour the ship. Let's start with a general look around, starting with the view forward and the rigging aloft. Here's the stern area. Let's go below to the engine room. In addition to sail power, the vessel was fitted with a single three-stage reciprocating steam engine that drives a single screw. What you're seeing here is the top end of the engine cylinders. Let's go all the way down. The ship was designed with an interesting rotor and propeller arrangement in that they could be raised up into the vessel to protect them from the ice. The propeller well can be seen behind the mannequin back in the corner there. We're now another deck down in the lower engine room. And here's the boiler. This area of the ship was originally used for coal and other storage. Through the cutaway in the deck you can see the iron ingot ballast that lined the bottom of the hull. Continuing to move forward, here's one of the several workshops and storage locker in this area. In this compartment you can see where some of the structural timbers that gave the vessel unusual strength and a bulkhead have been cut away and removed. Now a climb up one deck brings us to the galley where the cook is making dinner. Personally, I like to stay out of sick bay, but it's good to know it's there. Looks like a few crew members are enjoying a bit of downtime in the mess. Moving aft again, we're getting into officer country. And this here is the laboratory, followed by the ward room where the ship's officers meet for meals and to discuss plans and strategy. Around the perimeter of the ward room are the officers quarters. Up again to the main deck where we find the chart room. And finally back out onto the main deck and into the open. Exploring this grand piece of British naval history has been a lot of fun and well worth the time. As always, add a bit of adventure to your life and thanks for watching.